Hey there, I'm Dale with Open Road Outfitters. In this video series, we've been taking a look at the EasyCan accessory manager for Harleys and BMWs with a focus on using it for trailer lighting applications. I skipped over some of the advanced features and settings of the EasyCan, so in this final video in the series, I want to go back and take a look at some of those and show you what this software and this product can really do. So let's take a look at the brakes, for example. The default setting for the brakes is to go solid when you apply the brakes. But I know many folks have modules that flash when they install the rear brakes. So let's set the easy can to flash the rear brakes. Now, that may be a little much. Uh, in some states, that's not strictly legal. There's another setting on here for what's called California legal flashing. California legal flashing is four flashes followed by solid. That's pretty cool. I like that. I run that all the time. The other thing is that you can flash, uh, set these up to flash on an emergency stop or flash on rapid engine braking. Now I think that's really useful because you know as well as I do some of the tensest situations on the highway is when you see something slowing down in front of you and you slow down and you look in your rear mirrors and the person behind you, they ain't. Well, flashing those rear lights on sudden deceleration gives them a little more of a heads up. Maybe it gets their attention. A useful little feature here is the, uh, the diagnostics. If you want to see what kind of load your lights are drawing, this will give you uh, that kind of information, which can be useful. But what I like is that you can actuate these circuits independently. So if you're trying to figure out what's going on here with your wiring, you can just trigger these. There are just two other features that I want to mention that are related to trailering. So, let me show you this. Now, right now, I've got the five wire profile loaded, okay? Let's say that I'm hooking up to a four wire trailer, somebody else's trailer. I'm gonna to go to import and I'm gonna choose the four wire profile that I've set up here. And now, without doing anything else, this trailer is operating as a four-wire system. God, I love that. Now, uh, let's say I get back. You know, that, uh, that four-wire trailer may have belonged to a friend. I borrowed it. The next time I hook up my camper, I want my outputs to run as a five-wire system. And just like that, I'm back to a five-wire. I may be the only person who's excited about that, but I really like that feature a lot. Here's one more thing, and this is kind of a bonus setup that I sort of thought about. If you have a trailer or camper and it has all red lenses on the back and it is a five wire system, so you've got the, uh, the independent brake lights and turn signals like this. Um, a lot of the campers today are set up like this. Some cargo, but a lot of campers. You can use the Easy Can to operate this with brake lights all over the place. So I really think that can improve your visibility when you're towing the trailer. I call this high vis mode. Okay, so this operates with brake lights on all four lights. I'm making the top ones flash. Now I decided, okay. I don't want always flashing. I just want California flashing. So I'm going to save my settings. Okay, so now I've got that set. Okay, this is perfect. We've got California flashing on the top. We've got solid on the bottom. And we still have our brake lights or uh, turn signals. That's a lot of visibility. That's a heck of a lot better 
than just having brake lights show up on one set. That's cool. Oh yeah, there's one more thing. Now, when you get this easy can from me, I will send you any of these profile settings that I've created. All you have to do is download it and import it, and it'll work just like you've seen in the video here. Uh, the four wire setup, the five wire setup, or the, um, the max viz setup. So all you have to do then is create a plug, a wire harness with a plug to match your trailer, and you're done. Well, that's it for this series on the Easy Can uh, and how to use it uh, for trailering applications for Harleys and BMWs. I really hope you found this useful. And I have included links to the Easy Can in the description below this video. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos about motorcycle trailering and camping. And until next time, this is Dale with Open Road Outfitters wishing you many happy journeys.